She will never go to confront him directly even if she is thinking about him all day, all night. She will definitely stalk him on Facebook or Instagram a million times a day but won't go to him directly and say hey. I think you are cute. She will dedicate her precious time to searching for him all over social media, reading all his comments, seeing his friend list, and even having a look at the tagged people in his profile. But when he will be just standing right in front of her, she reacts like she doesn't even know him but in reality, she knows his family history and also the name of his neighbors. She might have even imagined herself in his arms when it will be raining outside. But when he will come before her, she even finds it difficult to raise her eyes and give him a look. If someday he will just stands near her, she might awkwardly show that she is the busiest person on the earth, and she doesn't even have time to notice that someone is standing near her. She will keep eye on his every single move when he is around her but never let him judge that. She will remember what he wore yesterday, a day before yesterday, or two years before. She might have observed him extensively while he is not looking and tried to find out every single detail about him. The rings in his hand, his hand accessory, the color of his eyes, the shape of his lips, the mole behind his neck, etc. From his frequently used words to all the shirts he wears, she knows all about him but will never dare to confront him as her heart and brain are indulged in the biggest battle to talk or to not to talk. Once she's shy around you, don't let the power suit fool you. Even the toughest career woman can turn into a shy schoolgirl in front of her crush. What you need to be aware of is that being shy can look very different from person to person. While some girls are the classic type who look down and blush, some may seem distant and aloof. If she's the second type, you have no way of knowing if that distance is because she's into you or she hates her guts. Watch out for this one important thing. If she's cold but sticks around, chances are that's her way of being shy and you'll need to be patient enough to break through that tough shell. If she's cold, distant, and avoids you at all costs, finding every excuse in the book to not be around you, you've got your answer. Two, she stands much closer to you than she has to. This one's probably gonna rock your world, but it's still very fucking true. If a girl is either neutral to you or thinks you're disgusting she's most likely gonna keep a professional distance from you whether she knows you or not. So, if she's actively decided to stand very close to you then there's a reason for it. Let's say you're in a bar or club that isn't absolutely jam-packed and there's a girl right next to you, then ask yourself why that is. She could be standing anywhere else right now but she's choosing to invade your airspace so why the hell is that? Well, it's because she most likely thinks you're hot and is hoping that you'll have the courage to talk to her. And if you think this is BS then realize that it isn't. This is a direct tactic that women use to encourage men they like to interact with them. They orbit you and hope you'll notice them. But anyway, let's say you're chatting with a group of friends and one of them is standing closer to you than anyone else and positioning her body in your direction. Well if that happens then she probably likes you, bro. She likes you, wants to be close to you, and is hoping that you'll realize it and do something about it. Remember that most girls don't even think they're allowed to be direct with guys they like. They literally think it's a social no-no so this is the sort of subtle thing they'll do to get your attention. 3. She touches you unnecessarily. Ever have a girl stand so close to you that her breasts press against your arm or chest? Or sit so close to you that her legs rub against yours? Or constantly touch you when she's talking to you? Or playfully hit you when you tell a joke? Ever have girls put their hands on your shoulder to steady themselves when they walk past even though they didn't actually have to do it? even though they could have steadied themselves on something else. Any physical contact that a girl initiates unnecessarily is a strong indicator of her interest. The more she goes out of her way to touch you then the more she likes you and it really is that simple. Remember that girls will go to major lengths to not do anything that could make them look like sluts. Being labeled a slut is one of the worst things that can happen to them and because of that, they try to avoid it at all costs. So this means that if one chooses to interact with you in a way that could possibly be construed as being even mildly sexual then that's something you really shouldn't ignore. 4. She watches your stories and likes your posts. Are there girls who watch all your IG, Snapchat, or FB stories without fail? Unless they're your family or close friends then it's a good sign that they like you or else why on earth would they be keeping up with your exploits? And just so you know, if a girl goes out of her way to like lots of your posts then that's about as massive a sign as you can get. You might think that if you like a girl's post that you're doing just that, liking the post itself, but they don't really see it that way. They tend to assume that a guy who likes their post is actually liking them and that's why lots of your female friends might not like your updates that often. Assuming that a girl either isn't into you sexually, or is but doesn't want to broadcast it, or just doesn't know you that well, then she usually won't like your posts even if she follows them closely. There are exceptions to this though, say if a post is so amazing or funny that it demands a like or if she knows for a fact that she won't look like she's dropping you hints by liking it. That's why girls will often feel more comfortable liking pics of guys with their girlfriends, children, or parents. 
In those situations, they think that liking a post like that won't imply that they're into the guy and trying to send him a slutty message. On a slight tangent, notice that when girls post pics with guys whom they're not in relationships with they'll usually make a point of letting everyone know he's just a friend in the post. They'll say something like had a great time with my brother from another mother today. And that's because they don't want anyone to possibly think they're being a whore. That's how important it is to them to look a certain way. And that's also why you should take real notice of any interest they outwardly show you. Anyway, my larger point is that if a girl is constantly following your stories or actively liking your posts then that's a huge sign that she likes you and you need to act on it quickly. I've specifically had girls say to me I've liked all your pics, how could you not see the signs I was sending you? 5. She teases you in any way. Remember when you were 7 on the school playground and you tease girls you liked by pushing them over or stealing something from them? Well, girls still do that as adults. Let's say you're in a club and some girl grabs your hat and runs off with it in a fit of giggles while she's basically asking you to play with her. She's literally saying, Hey, I think you're cool and I want you to interact with me so I'm gonna force you to do it by stealing your hat. Please talk to me. Girls don't interact with guys they don't like so remember that. 6. She doesn't acknowledge you at all. This one gonna seem odd considering everything I've said so far but it's still true so here goes. Basically, you need to realize that some girls are simply more confident than others and that even though some will have the courage to touch or tease you to get your attention, some will just freeze up like an Eskimo's ball sack when they're in your presence. Let's say you're in a group of friends and one of them is a girl you don't know and who isn't interacting with you in the slightest. Let's say she won't look at you or talk to you at all, and when you ask her questions she responds to someone else instead of to you. If that happens, there's a damn good chance that she likes you so much that she's freezing up and doesn't know what to do. Of course, she might actually hate you but realistically unless you're genuinely an unlikable asshole that's probably not the case. Also, girls tend to like and trust guys that their friends vouch for so if you have mutual friends there's no real reason for her to actively dislike you. 7. She glances in your direction. Does she keep looking up at you quickly before going back to whatever she was doing? Well unless you look like you haven't washed in months then this is a huge sign that she thinks you look delicious. 8. Her feet are pointed towards you. When people are in a group conversation they'll often angle themselves towards the person they're either most interested in or attracted to. Let's say you're in a group of friends and one of the girls is facing you rather than someone else then that should tell you something about where her interest lies. 9. She mirrors your body language. There's a subconscious reaction called mirroring that people do when they like someone and it basically means copying their body language. So here's how this would look. Imagine you're having a conversation with a girl. And then cross your arms, lean back, rest an elbow on the table, lean forward, and then take a sip of your drink. If the girl you're with copies all of that then she's mirroring you and likes you. Now it doesn't necessarily mean that she's into you, but there's a damn good chance that she is. 10. She actively tries to keep the conversation going. How many times have you been either talking to a girl in person or through DMs and noticed that you were putting all the effort into keeping the conversation going? That you were the one asking follow-up questions and that she was responding to everything you said with either yes or no answers or just closed-ended responses that did nothing to further the conversation. Well, the truth is that when girls aren't that interested in talking to you they won't put any effort into trying to keep things interesting and will let you do all the work. But, when they're actively engaging with the conversation, when they ask you follow-up questions to keep things moving then that's because they want to talk to you and it's a huge indicator of the fact that they're probably into you. 11. She laughs at your jokes. This one is tried and true but it's still worth mentioning. If a girl goes out of her way to let you know that she thinks you're funny then that's a massive indicator of her interest. Girls like to laugh and guys that can make them do that are like gold dust to them. So this means that if she's constantly laughing at your jokes, or even at times when you're not trying to be funny then she either genuinely finds you hilarious or she wants you to think that she thinks you're hilarious. Either way, it's an excellent sign that you need to have a proper word with her at SAP. 12. Her friends know who you are. Do her friends say hey whenever they see you, even though they hardly know you? It's most likely because she's spoken to them about you at length. A girl might not openly tell a guy that she's into, but she will tell her squad so if they know who the hell you are and seem to like you too then it's probably because she's really into you and has been talking to you up massively. Hell, they've probably group-stocked your social media profiles too.